There's a lot of stuff going on in that book. Did you actually write this book? I did, and I worked with a collaborator. And while I was um, trying to get ideas for the book, I was actually filming in Seaside. So we would get an hour um, a week on the phone with our people, our managers and stuff like that. So I'd be like, okay, all I want to do is talk about my book. I want this and there, that and there. And then I would proofread everything, make sure everything's how I want it to be. And then... Just as Hemingway did it. So there was somebody that actually typed it all out for you. Um, I gave her all the ideas and I just wanted her to put it like I wanted it to mm -hmm. and if I didn't like it, I would make it over. You would change it. Yeah. Did you ever argue with her? Well, yes, because she is a Jersey girl. So she kinda knew what I was talking about, but she was like I think it should be this way. And I was like, no, it's going to be this way. And so, but you get the final say because oh, it's your name on the book. Yeah. When you found out you'd be working with a ghostwriter, did you get scared? No ghostwriters, we are. Well, that's what they call them, right? No, the collaborators? Not mine. Oh. Do you read what's in there? Well, I don't see her <laughs> name on it, so that makes her a ghostwriter, doesn't no. it? No. No? No? Oh, all right. Yeah, you get back to me. Okay, all right. No, okay, I will read it. I'll write you a little book report on it. <laughs> yeah. And is, is there some dirty stuff in here? Oh, yeah. But I made sure that I calmed it down a little bit because I know, like, you know, a lot of younger girls are going to want to read that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't want to be that bad of an example. What, are you, what, books, like, what books are you interested in? Um, well, I definitely like Dear John and the Twilight series. What is Dear John? 